Yo what's up guys it's Aptrix here in today's video we'll be setting up the official RPCS3 emulator for android devices so right here you will be able to see i have added the RPCS3 version 1.0 alpha build on my mobile device and in today's video i'll be setting it up i'll be importing some ps3 titles and testing out how well does it work on our mobile device now to start off yesterday i made a video talking about official main developer of RPCS3 working on the RPCS3 android port and i had assumed that we need to wait for about 6 months before we get to see the official official launch of this emulator but no guys the developer of RPCS3 has finally released the RPCS3 Android port alpha test build hashtag #1 and this is just the alpha version this is not the main version this is just for testing purposes it is so basic that you will be able to see it doesn't even have a logo right now even APS3 emulator got a logo but RPCS3 does not have a logo so yeah this is just in early stages and the developer will indeed provide lot of updates in future with that being said let's just go and tap on RPCS3 emulator and simply tap on on don't allow and before getting started if you guys are new here then make sure to hit that like button subscribe turn on all notification as i upload similar videos on my channel i'll be covering each and every single update of the rpcs3 android port along with gameplay test of games like god of war gta 5 low end device gameplay test and much more so make sure to subscribe as you don't want to miss out those videos with that being said let's get started so first of all when you just go and launch this emulator you will see the rpcs3 text afterwards you will see an ui at the top left corner and a plus button now let me show you guys how to set up this emulator just tap on the top left corner to import your firmware so here i have selected my ps3 firmware from official sony you will be able to see firmware 4.91 and now we'll just go and go back you will be able to see the home menu or xmb of playstation 3 has been successfully added so the firmware import doesn't really take that much time at least on high end android devices the next thing which we'll do is start importing our ps3 games inside this emulator for that simply tap on this plus button and make sure to import your games for to this video will be trying out some demo games so let me import all of them all right now here you guys will be able to see i have imported some of the ps3 demo titles which will be trying out in today's video starting off let's just go ahead and open the sonic cd trial and as you guys can see the game crashed but we'll open it once again and our game will successfully start the first thing which you'll immediately notice is the fact that when you launch a game you will see the same ui of compiling ppu models just like we see in the aps3 e emulator and i want to be completely honest about rpcs3 android port alpha version 1 build currently there are no on screen touch controls this is the point one second point is that you cannot map controls for now so you can't even use external game pads like your ps5 controller or any other game pad that you might have as far as i know i personally haven't tested it out and i am trying the simulator at the same time in front of you guys one thing which i can say for sure is that aps3 emulator is more optimized than the current build of rpcs3 but that will be short lived because i know rpcs3 team and the developers are very amazing and talented we just need to give them some time about 6 months and we will see the best playstation 3 emulator for android devices and you will be able to see compiling ppu models is just taking lot of time whereas in aps3 e this entire process happens within few seconds on a high end android device the device which i am using is realme gt7 pro with snapdragon 8 elite but let's wait for few minutes until it's done and guys even after waiting for 5 minutes you will be able to see our loading process is completely stuck now i know this occurs and that's because none of the games will actually work inside the rpcs3 emulator android this alpha build is not able to boot any game games except for i guess sonic during the process of linking ppu models the emulator just freezes and the loading process does not go any further so that's it for the rpcs3 emulator's version 0.1 build i would recommend you guys to not bug the developer uh, about how all the games are not working obviously the developer just want to prove that this is an real emulator and it is currently work under progress so you just have to support the developers be patient and wait until we get some more updates of this emulator where few games are playable and i'll be the first one to let you guys know when this simulator is completely stable and can emulate games like god of war grand theft auto and lot more so anyways that's going to be it for today's video thanks for watching hit that like button i'll see you guys in my next video goodbye and peace out